In this presentation, we will be talking about percentage and its interconversion. That how we can convert person into fraction form, and a fraction form into a percentage. Before jumping into my lecture, please subscribe our YouTube channel for upcoming presentation. Percentage. Percentage is derived from a Greek word percentum, which means a hundred. So person means per hundred. Percentage are the ratios that compare a quantity to hundred. For example, thirty-three percent means thirty-three per hundred, and it can also be written as thirty-three divided by hundred or zero point three three. Please keep in mind this symbol. Percent means dash, which means division. So the word percent means divide. Uh, division and cent cent is actually stands for hundred and of means multiplication. This symbol is usually used for the process of multiplication. So per means division, cent means hundred, and of means multiplication. Uh, there are some basic formulas. Which can be used in order to find the percentage. The simple formula for percentage is equal to given amount divided by total amount multiplied by hundred. Or there is also another formula which can be stated that percentage is equal to part divided by whole. And multiply by hundred. So these two are the basic formulas for percentage. Now there are some other formulas of uh, which are given in increase or decrease of percentage. Formula for increase or decrease. There are also some formulas which are used. For increased value of percentage and decreased value of percentage. For example, we have this simple formula: percentage is equal to increase in value, original value, and multiplied by hundred. Or percentage decrease is equal to de decrease in value, original value, multiplied by hundred. uh these formulas will be discussed in our next presentation because in this presentation we will be talking about interconversion of percentage into each other now examples of person as a fraction how can we convert person into a fraction for these types of question we have a very simple term that is percent is equal to 1 by 100 for example 3% is equal to 3 by 100 here for percentage we can write 1 by 100 uh our 25% is equal to 25 divided by 100 which comes out to be 1 by 4 because uh this is divisible by 25 so 25 one za and 25 four za the answer will be 1 by 4 or 57 person is equal to 57 divided by 100 similarly 2 person is equal to 2 by 
uh, that comes out to be 1 by 50 that is 2 ones uh, and 2 fifties uh. so these are some simple formulas or terms uh, uh, through which we can convert um, person into a fraction form and for this we usually use this simple term that is percentage is equal to 1 by 100 so keep in mind this term always now examples of fraction is a percentage now how can we convert a fraction form into a person for this we have this simple term that is the opposite of the last one uh, 1 by 100 is equal to percent uh, in these questions a uh, fraction form that is 11 by 100 is given and we can write uh, this uh, into a percentage that uh, that is 11 is equal to uh, sorry uh, 11 by 100 is equal to 11 percent similarly 1 by 5 is equal to 20 by 100 which comes out to be 20 percent so for this term we multiply denominator and denominator by 20 so if we multiply 20 over here it comes out to be 20 divided by 100 which means 20 percent similarly 77 divided by 100 is equal to 70 percent and same likely 1 by 10 1 by 10 is equal to 10 percent but as you know that uh, here we have in denominator 10 so if you multiplied this term by 10 so we will get uh, 10 divided by 100 which comes out to be 10 percent uh, similarly examples of person as a decimal how can we convert a person into a decimal uh, for these types of question we simply divide the given person by 100 and for that uh, we move the decimal and for that term we move the decimal point two spaces to the left now look at here for example 65 person as we know that uh, it means 65 divided by 100 and if we divide this by 100 we get 0.65 uh, here if we see that uh, 65 divided by 100 so usually we have a decimal point over here so divided by 100 means that a decimal point two spaces to the left so one space and two spaces so this point will be uh, put over here and similarly 5.5% uh, is equal to 5.5 divided by 100 which comes out to be 0 0.055 if we look at here 0.05 here the decimal point will move over here like one space and two space to the left so we will get uh, this term like as it is given as similarly two person is equal to 0.02 and 50% uh, will be is equal to 0 0.5 please note that in order to turn a fraction into a person we usually divide the nominator that is top of the fraction 
divided by denominator that is bottom of the fraction and also remember any number that doesn't have a decimal point if there is no decimal point with a number uh, that is invisible decimal point at the far right of a number means that uh, this number has a decimal point at the end of this digit but usually we don't uh, write uh, decimal point with numbers uh, it means that each and every number have a decimal point uh, at the end of that uh, number uh, as it is given that 14 so here in 14 the decimal point is written as here now let's solve in another example 5 out of here the question is 5 out of 8 album that early on are jazz so what person of his music collection is jazz here the number is very clear 5 out of 8 which means 5 divided by 8 and we are supposed to find the percentage of this figure so now it is very clear we have to convert the fraction into a percentage so 5 divided by 8 comes out to be 0 0.625 now move the decimal two spaces to the right and include or put a percent sign in other words multiply this term with 100 and put a percentage sign with it so jazz make, makes up 62 percent of ali's music collection so here our answer is 62.5 percent now there are some questions for self practice uh, which will let you know that how much you have learned uh, from this presentation and these are very simple question uh, question one state is that right uh, 45 percent is a fraction uh, 268 is a fraction 275 is a fraction 8 is a decimal 95 0.4 as a decimal and same here and here question 7 state is that 6 divided by 20 is what person you are supposed to find the percentage of the fraction in question number 7 and 8 and in question number 9 in school election Tammy received 3 out of every 7 votes what person of votes was this you are supposed to find the percentage of the votes but uh, approximate the nearest person in other words round off your answer into a perfect figure uh, in question number 10 if you get 17 out of 20 questions correct on your next test what person of the test did you answer incorrectly for example if you find the percentage over here that will be your correct answer but you are supposed to find out what person you have done wrong so please solve these questions and put the answer into a comment box i will post the right answer in whenever you tried these so for right answer check your comment box later on after trying uh, thank you for watching